Hey folks, uh, today I figured I'd uh, take you on a little tour of my bedroom. Close that door. Uh, my bedroom slash music studio. This is on the top floor of my house. Uh, definitely one of the hottest rooms in the house, so that's one downside, but um, yeah, so this is my stairway. Got some nice neon lighting. You, uh, random video game posters can't really see right now because it's dark in here but uh, enter my room here yeah it's a nice little space uh, I have my own room in my house and uh, my girlfriend has her own room and yeah um, but yeah this is uh, pretty much when we bought this house or rented this house we uh, Decided that this was going to be my music room, so it's kind of what I've been trying to make it into. Um, so I got quite a few instruments in here, pretty much uh, more than a full band's worth. Got some other guitars under the bed, which you can't see right now, but uh, here's my main acoustic guitar, the uh, Fender DG40 that I've had for probably 20 years or so, <laughs> maybe. Maybe 18 years, but yeah, great guitar. There's my uh, Fender Mustang 4 amp. It's a nice, uh, nice amp for practicing in here. I'm sure it would be good enough for live shows too. This I got a little more recently, Luna Acoustic. Um, pretty happy with it. It was, it was a cheap guitar, actually, as far as price, but um, yeah, it sounds really good. Uh, I've had that for a while. Orange Crush 50 watt bass amp, another uh, old bass to go with it that my friend gave me, another bass there. Uh, I got this couch put in just because it felt like it's, uh made it look a little more like a studio, plus I didn't really have any seating in here, so got that for pretty cheap. Some fancy pillows, um, yeah, I keep a lot of artwork and pictures in here. As you know, I've kind of gone by the name of Memory Collector over the years, so it's just a lot of uh, memory-related stuff. Pictures of my dad, um, just other artwork that people I know have done. Here's the uh, album art and cover, or the, the lyrics for um, Modest Mouse's... Um, <clears throat> this is a long drive for someone with nothing to think about. One of my favorite albums. Haley Williams silk screen, silk screen poster. Uh, yeah, I've always kind of had an obsession with her, but yeah, that's a whole other story. A <laughs> um, couple random uh, anime artifacts that I've picked up over the years from like uh, Otakon, which is a pretty popular anime anime convention, uh, sort of in the Baltimore Inner Harbor area. Uh, GTA Five. My favorite games. Nice uh, Radiohead poster from OK Computer. Uh, this is uh, the Mackie Reach, a new PA system I got. It's pretty sweet. It's got Bluetooth controls. Um, you can control it with a tablet. So I hope to use that for live shows sometime. If I can get anywhere to book me. <clears throat> um, it's a... Uh, my ESP guitar I've had for quite some time, probably since about mm, maybe 08 or so. Uh, Pearl Cajon, haven't gotten to use that much, but I'm sure it'll come into play sometime. This spot's reserved for a new um, Roland synth that I'm going to be getting sometime soon, in the next like few days or so. Um, so that space is just reserved there. A couple microphones set up. Um, this is my favorite synthesizer here that I have right now, the Nord Lead A1. It's an analog modeling synthesizer, so not quite analog, but definitely has the sound. Um, it's just a little blurry. Just gonna wipe off the lens here. There we go. Um, Arturia Drum Brute, pretty nice uh, analog drum synth that I got recently. Um, just my 
laptop that I pretty much do everything on. It's gonna need to be replaced soon, probably. And then just a little uh, synth set up here. Got some Korg Volkas. Um, yeah, pretty nice little synths to uh, add to the mix. Um, yeah, they all kind of connect together, so you can you know sync them up, and they have you know you can pr program beats on them. Pretty sweet. I have some. Uh, I don't even remember who makes these monitors now. I really can't remember, but not bad monitors for this smaller room here. Um, yeah, and then just a older keyboard that I sometimes use for mini MIDI. Uh, yeah, here I got some just random stuff, old video games, my favorite older games that I kept, like uh, RE4, Half-Life, uh, GTA series and such. I mostly just play my uh, Xbox One now. Usually, sometimes I'll get on uh, Black Ops 3 and just, uh, you know, do some ponage or whatever. Alright, so yeah, it's pretty much where the magic happens, or doesn't happen, depending on how I feel. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm supposed to get a new uh, Elisis drum set soon, so that's going to be cool. It's a, an electronic drum kit, but I've always wanted to learn to play drums, and maybe if I get good enough, I'll start adding some live electronic drums into the mix. Uh, here's my bed, where I sleep. Nothing special, uh, probably gonna have to be taken out soon because I'm kind of running out of room in here as you can see. But, um, yeah, I'm definitely not a, a rich person or anything, I've just been able to kind of acquire this gear over the past few years, just financing it online through uh, Sweetwater.com. They have a pretty nice credit card that, you know, I can buy stuff and just pay monthly on it for a period, so... Even though uh, some of this stuff's pretty pricey, um, I was able to get it just for really low monthly payments, so totally worth it, as long as I can, you know, keep up with the uh, credit card payments there. <laughs> but, um, yeah, this is where I like to make my music. Um, just a nice little chill space here. I wish I could uh, take more people into this room and have them hang out, but... Only a few select people that I know have even been up here. It's because, I don't know, kind of live in a, a rural area, sort of, um, central PA. And, yeah, I don't really know all that many people here. Just moved here a few years ago, so... It's hard to find anybody to really make music with that's completely serious about it. Um, <clears throat> but, yeah, until I find those people, I guess I'm kind of the... The one man band here. Um, I'm planning on doing a new, couple new albums late, or uh, soon, hopefully. I've been working with my Russian band, for Cowboy, uh, who I've been working with the past three years or so. Uh, we're going to be releasing a new album sometime this year, probably, I assume. Might be another self release because it's just so hard to find labels these days. So much competition and it's all about being in the right place at the right time, but yeah, my main goal in kind of building up this uh, collection here, which has gotten much bigger in recent years, um, you know, I just, I want to just continue to make music and write albums and, you know, hope that someday I can make something out of this. I work at a, a call center for DirecTV, so... If you have AT&T or DirecTV, you might just uh, get me if you're trying to reach tech support there. But, um, yeah, you know, it's just a an okay job. It's not really, you know, my dream or anything, obviously. But, uh, yeah, that's kind of where I'm at right now, just working. I completed a couple years of college, maybe go back someday. But until then, this is my... My main focus really is just music, and uh, I hope to have some more new content for you guys soon. Alright, well, uh hope you enjoyed the tour of my room. I'll catch you guys later. Peace.